listening to Catholic Sprouts, the daily podcast for Catholic kids that strives to plant seeds of faith. Hey there, Sprouts. Today is Monday, January 8th, 2024. This week on the Catholic Sprouts podcast, we are going to return to the most basic the most fundamental, the most important topic. And that topic is simply Jesus Christ. In these weeks, as we approach the season of Lent, it is very important that we sort of refocus our attention on Jesus Christ. And so this week we are going to talk about something that is most important to understand about Jesus. And that is the fact that he was not only 100% human, he was also 100% God. So we're going to spend this week really evaluating the reasons why we know this to be true. But before we do that, let's all remember that we are, no matter how old we are, we are students of our Lord, students of the Christian life. And so let's pray together the prayer for students that St. Elizabeth Ann Seton is challenging us to learn this month in the Be a Saint Kids Club. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, amen. Lord, our God, In your wisdom and love, you surround us with the mysteries of the universe. Send your spirit upon us and fill us with your wisdom and blessings. Grant that we may devote ourselves to our studies. Through them, draw us ever closer to you, the source of all knowledge. We ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen. So as I said, this week we are studying Jesus Christ and reminding ourselves that the most important thing for us to know about Jesus is that he is God. Throughout the ages, and especially now in our world, there seems to be an overemphasis on Jesus's human qualities, and he was indeed fully human. But it is a very dangerous thing to begin to think that he was nothing more than a great teacher or a prophet. He was infinitely more than a great teacher or a prophet. He was, is, and continues to be God. In fact, at the very beginning of the Gospel of John, we hear that in the beginning, there was the Word. And this word is Jesus Christ. Now, to understand this, you need to go all the way back to the very first words of the Bible, back to the book of Genesis. In the story of creation, we hear that God was there and that he spoke the world into existence, that he spoke the world, that he used word to create. Now, I know this is a very complex thing to understand, and I'm not quite sure what it looked like, but Jesus himself was the very word that God spoke at the moment of creation. So God, Jesus, this tiny baby that we will sell, that we celebrated the birth of at Christmas, that this tiny baby was there at the creation of the world and that he took on human flesh and did all the human things out of love for us, but he remained truly God. Now, there are lots of things that Jesus did during his public ministry that are recorded in the gospel that make it clear that he was not just claiming to be a prophet or a really good guy, but he was indeed telling people that he was God that there was no one that had come like him before or would come like him after, that he was the second person of the Trinity, God himself. And so Sprouts, as we really meditate upon this, the fact that Jesus is God, I want to remind you that the whole month of January is dedicated to the most holy name of Jesus. We talked about this last week, but I want to remind you that the very name of Jesus has power. And this is because he is, is God. And so again, today, just take a moment, especially maybe if you're feeling stressed or worried, if you have a big emotional reaction to something that happens, 
I want you to find a moment of quiet to just repeat the name of Jesus and remind yourself that because he is indeed God, his name has power. That's it for Catholic Sprouts today. We'll be back tomorrow. But until then, continue to grow in your faith and truly sprout into the beautiful creation that God created you to be. We are excited to announce the release of a brand new, beautiful hardcover Jesus Tree devotional to take your family through Lent this year. Full of beautiful new images, revamped devotions, We know you're going to love it. It's on sale right now. Just follow the link in this podcast episode's notes. This podcast is part of the Spoke Street Network. For more great podcasts, visit Spokestreet.com.